Hi, I'm Serene, and welcome to another episode of the New York Auto Show After Dark. Let's check out what's going on behind the scenes. Hey there, Sil Dominguez. I heard you needed two tickets to the New York Auto Show, so here you go. Welcome to In the Back Seat. I'm here with David Sweet of Volkswagen, and I'd like to invite you to loosen your ties since we're in the back seat. And also, I wanted to ask you a little bit about this new car from Volkswagen, the Bully. Sure, this is our new Bully concept. It's a concept car that takes some of the great emotion of the classic, iconic VW bus and brings it up to date with a, with a modern package and a lot of up-to-date features and infotainment options. And it's absolutely spacious in the back here, and I don't know if you guys can see this, but the ceiling is totally clear, so it just makes for amazing light, and I'm sure if you were like in Yellowstone National Park, this would just be an amazing family car. So tell me, what's one of the most unique features in this concept well, car? One of the really unique features is that there's an iPad that's integrated into the controls of the car. So that's it amazing. interacts back and forth with the vehicle. Some of the controls are on the iPod itself, some are on the vehicle. If we get a good enough response to it, we might see something just like it on the road someday. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time in In the Backseat. We asked our Facebook and Twitter fans to submit questions about this year's auto show. Gita M. Rita Dioshand asked, will the 2012 Jeep SR T8 be present at the show? And you're in luck, the Jeep is here, so come on down and see it. Hey there, I'm here with the cast of Rescue Inc. So guys, what brings you to the Javits Center today and the New York International Auto Show? Well, we're here to promote awareness about abuse and neglect. We're also here for Bark, Buckle Up. It's to make sure all the dogs that ride around in everybody's vehicles are, are all buckled up and they're safe. And they're safe. And what sort of safety, new safety precautions should we take for our dogs when they ride with us in the car? Well, Bark, Buckle Up, they've actually made seat belts for dogs. You know, a lot of times you got the dog in the car right. and you're sitting there talking, right. er, you hit yeah. the brakes, boom, bad things happen. So what you got to do is you got to always make sure the dog is secured. It's safer for the dog and it's safer for you. How many dogs do you guys have? At the sanctuary we have anywhere from at one time 50 to 100. I have uh, three pit bulls. You know, we all have dogs that we just can't part with. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, guys, for the work that you do and for raising our awareness about keeping our, our best friends safe uh, in the car. Uh, yeah. Also, if anybody wants to get in touch with us, they go on our Facebook pages, which is Rescue Inc. Inc. is spelled I-N-K. And also, Rescue Inc. Dot com. Earlier today I posted a car engine online and asked you to identify the car. Now it's time to reveal the answer. It is the world debut here at the New York International Auto Show of the Subaru Impreza. Another busy night at the New York Auto Show. Thanks for joining me. I'll see you tomorrow night.